Hello friends, in last video we have to see the practical for Maxwell model. So now today we are going to start the fifth practical Zener characteristics. So in this uh, Zener characteristics uh, we have studied in this experiment the Zener diamond characteristics. So first we have all to discuss uh, about what is the aim uh, is our experiment. So the aim is our experiment is uh, the, uh, study the characteristics of Zener diode for determination of breakdown voltage of Zener Vz. So see in this chart the um, diagram circuit diagram of this Zener diode. So then uh, I have to discuss the experimentally. So first we write down this uh, uh, chart and uh, how much the uh, scene diagram we get the 15 volt battery, Zener diode, this reverse star. I experiment, experimentally explain just to you draw the circuit diagram and uh, this procedure. So experimentally I discuss about this procedure, connect the circuits. Uh, uh, we can um, connecting the all circuits uh, as a diagram we have to see. So change the voltage across the steps, uh, voltage across the current uh, is not down in millimeter. So we have to get the one uh, 15 volt battery in this apparatus for home and uh, Zener diode, rheostat. So voltage uh, across current measurement millimeter voltmeter we have to them so this uh, experimental procedure we have to write down and after that we can write down the chart observation table serial number voltage and current voltage across zener and current across zener and then lastly we have to write the results of breakdown voltage so so I can uh, experiment tell you procedure we have to discuss it. So see in this experiment is the voltmeter then milliameter these are the diode kit and then this is the experimentally I have to explain the procedure of this experiment. Firstly we have to explain the AC. These are the power supply then these are the rheostat then voltmeter milliameter so this is the kit of Zener diode so it is this is the 100 ohm resistance of Zener diode then uh, this is the Zener diode 100 ohm resistance and uh, where the the resistor uh, Zener diode is uh, anode cathode terminal. So first uh, we have to discuss about the connections. First uh, these are the rheostats fixed terminal is a variable terminal. First I tell you battery one. Battery's positive connections goes on rheostat fixed terminal. So then Diodes and batteries negative terminal is goes to connections in where uh, in your rheostat another terminal. So then uh, we have to see the diodes part of cathode is connected to voltmeter positive terminal see now is connected to voltmeter 
डायोड कैथोड पार्ट इज कनेक्टेड टू द होल्ट मीटर पॉजिटिव टर्मिनल सो देन आफ्टर दैट डायोड्स नेगेटिव मीन्स एनोड पार्ट इज कनेक्टेड टू होल्ट मीटर नेगेटिव टर्मिनल सी पार्ट इज कनेक्टेड टू होल्ट मीटर्स नेगेटिव टर्मिनल देन होल्ट मीटर्स टू गोज टू इन फिक्स वेरिएबल पॉइंटर सी to do that they explain as shown in diagram we have to discuss it so then after that diodes positive terminal is goes to the voltmeters milliameters diode positive terminal goes to milliameters negative as shown in the circuit diode positive goes to milliameters negative terminal and 100 ohm resistance goes to voltmeter positive terminal then we have to complete is this connections as shown in circuit see all these connections as uh, Uh, defined in your uh, circuit diagram i completed it then we have to start the experiment so this is the voltmeter across current note down is the voltmeter is uh, 0 to 2 the uh, 0 to 2 so in this uh, uh, line difference including the the points what the one one line value is 0. Two, we including the four power, five lines. So that uh, the ratio that the um, that that is the means one line's uh, value is zero point two. We increase the voltage for uh, two lines means zero point four volt and corresponding current we have to note down this milli ammeter. you have to show it how can be experiment we have to perform c and and then after that you you so you have to continuously write, write down the reading across the voltmeter c how can we explain this we have to explain the readings how can be calculate voltmeter across milli ammeter sure In this way. So first we have increased the voltage corresponding to point two four volt. So I have to increase the two lines. The corresponding current in milliameter not increase. It is fixed. so you have to write down the current across zero then we increase the 0.4 0.4 the ratio then we get the 0.8 then ratio then corresponding current now see in the milliameter is also zero then we have to increase the current in 1.2 volt current should be zero then we increase the 1.6 current 
should be 0.2 then 2.0 current should be 0.2 so current across that 0.2 so we have to see the 0.4 so the ratio will be here write down the then uh, across the current voltage will be corresponding voltage will be we, when we increase the voltage then corresponding the in the uh, current will be not increase the voltage we are according to this measure is we have to write down the zero another readings for calculating the voltage will be constant the current will be increase then write down the three or four readings at that time current should be constant we see in voltage voltmeter current not vary voltage cons, sorry current vary voltage should be constant so at that point i have to get this heading so then we have to explain how can be the corresponding voltage across the current i should explain see first reading zero volt voltage then across current zener circuit is zero then increasing to one reading 0.4 0.4 we get the 0.4 0.8 so voltage sorry corresponding current should be constant with which it will be zero then 1.6 we get current 0.2 then 2.0 0.4 and uh, we get the in this way we can be perform the the experimentally then corresponding 0.2.4 we get the 0.4 and uh, we can we get the increasing voltage according to that of point is a constant so 2.8 is 0.4 3.2 0.5 3.4 should be 0.6 and uh, 3.6 we get the 1.8 reading and at uh, four volt constant it can be not be increased in one it should be constant current will be increased it should have to see in the experiment after that we have to uh, after completing the reading we calculate the graph so by using graph we get uh, the zener voltage see uh, how can we calculate the graph see in this uh, paper in on y axis we get the put the zener current in y axis the um, scale we have to denote is 0.3 0.6 0.9 1.2 1.2 to 6 and uh, on x axis we put um, the uh, here voltage voltmeter readings and uh, here uh, input uh, and on x axis we get the uh, we can increase the voltmeter reading 0.4 so we here put the 0.8 0.8 up to 4 here zener uh, current will should be constant so then on x axis 1 cm is equal to 0.4 and on y axis 1 cm is equal to 0.3 volt so 
voltage across current we have to plot in y axis and x axis then we plot the graph on this 0 0.4 to here showing breakdown voltage graph see in the diagram so according to that of reading we have we, you can plot the graph in the graph paper so and corresponding zener breakdown voltage you should be note down these are this is the result of our experiment so thank you